With this exponential rate of technology changes, the shelf life for skills in 2020 is two to five years at best. So it's so important right now to really embrace this culture of continuous learning in order to succeed in this fourth industrial revolution. While you're probably doing a job that didn't exist in 1940, the real question is, will the job that you have now be around in 2040? In order to really sustain and, and your growth and survive in the fourth industrial revolution, it's imperative that both individuals and organizations embrace continuous learning as a part of their DNA. According to the World Economic Forum, 50% of the global workforce today it needs to be reskilled or upskilled. In five years, that number jumps to 90%. That creates a real problem for organizations. The way to adapt to that is to create a culture of learning at your organization, really make it a key part of your strategy. If you want to learn about AI, if you want to learn about data, machine learning, cloud, security, uh, Pluralsight is the platform to come to learn those skills. Pluralsight was founded in order to provide the skills needed to upskill engineers who are really looking to learn more about hardcore tech. This was a in the classroom, hands-on experience that was led by instructors and was really delivered, you know, in, human to human, and then transformed that model into the online skills platform that we know today as Pluralsight. In 2024, we were ranked as one of the leading companies in EdTech by Time Magazine. Pluralsight is trusted by over half of America's Fortune 500 companies. Our mission is to connect skills with outcomes. So our content is created and vetted by a network of over 2,500 authors that 91% of them have over 10 years of industry experience. The key differentiator for Pluralsight is our author network. When we work closely with the company to design a curriculum that's targeted at the needs that, that they're working on at that moment, we find that they can upskill their organization without having to go to an expensive outside agency or hire you know, 20 new people with the skills that they actually need. They can retrain their existing workforce. Our hands-on labs and sandboxes allow you to spin up environments that are near real world, they're completely secure, and they don't cost any extra money. Um, and that is what makes those labs kind of so important for companies and so effective at bringing users up to skill quickly. So what's unique about Pluralsight is that we're the only technology learning platform that's 100% dedicated to technology skills development for the workforce of the modern organization. As a part of the support that we provide to the many administrators who work with us within our customer base, the things that they need in order to successfully run their businesses and ensure that they're upskilling employees is a couple of things. One is having access to data and analytics, which we provide to them so that they can assess the progress that their employees are making as they're using the platform. The second big thing that we offer is assessments. Things like Skills IQ allow employers to be able to benchmark their employees across different skill sets and in specific roles to really understand how their workforce stacks up to many of the other organizations around the globe. So for long-term success, I think it really comes down to three things. One, you need to establish that basic digital literacy. Does everybody have the foundations? Can everybody speak the language? Do you understand the basics of the technology? The second thing, you need to put that paper into practice with fluency. So how do you go ahead and take that literacy and start using it with hands-on labs and sandboxes? 
apply those skills and start to use them to build something. Lastly, and most importantly, you have to build critical mass. You have to get outside of the echo chamber of these early adopters to be able to create social consensus with that literacy and that fluency. So that means democratizing skills development across your entire organization. We launched a philanthropic venture called Pluralsight One to expand access to tech education for communities that may not have the resources to learn these critical skills. We issue grants and establish partnerships around the world to level the playing field and make access to education more equitable. We know the skills gap in tech is massive and there are not enough individuals to fill the tech jobs today. We get a lot of feedback from our customers about our courses and it's very inspiring to read actually. The overwhelming majority of the feedback is Pluralsight changed my life. It allowed me to, you know, double my income and afford a new house and it had a real impact on my family and those are the kinds of stories that get me out of bed in the morning and get me coming to work with a, a, a smile on my face knowing that I'm making a difference in the world.